everybody, it's Mona, and we have an unscheduled video today because I want to talk about spilling my own tea. What we're going to talk about real quick today is some big changes that I am making personally. So the first thing is I'm changing my name. Well, not my name. My name is going to stay Mona. I'm changing the name of my channel to better reflect my authentic self. The new name of the channel is going to be About Face with Mona. I wasn't being authentic with myself, which really isn't unusual for me because by nature, I am a people pleaser. But that's contra-indicatory to everything that I started this YouTube channel for. So I started this YouTube channel because I am about to hit my 50s. I am 49. I am trying to find myself again, like probably many of you here. And we talked about this a little bit in the last vlog, but I didn't capitalize on what I was saying. The changes that I'm making is one, the channel name. The content is not going to change too much except to say that it's really just going to be more authentic to who I am. We are going to try all kinds of things. We don't know where this journey will take us. It might take me to neon eyeshadows. It might take me to neon lipsticks. It might take me bungee jumping. It might take me on what do you call those zip lines through the Amazon <laughs> jumping out of planes. I don't really think so because I'm scared of heights, but you get the idea. We don't know where the journey is going to take me. It is going to take me wherever it's going to take me. We're going to find out what beauty products I really like. What is my look? You know, what looks best on my skin at this age? I'm going to be trying a whole heap of things. So I think the most value that this channel is going to bring you is going to be how we adjust at changes of chapters in our life and how we continue to thrive despite the fact that life throws us some curves like new wrinkles, new lines, new sagging, new bagging, new friends. You know, some doors close and some doors open. We can't just crawl up in a ball that we have to we have to meet those challenges and those changes head on and we need to use them to fuel us into more positive, better, productive things so that we don't stagnate. How can we be more fulfilling, not less fulfilling? How can we be more fulfilled ourselves than less fulfilled? And that's what this journey is all about. And so my channel content will highly be about reviewing what's working and what's not and what I'm liking and what I'm not. Some will be faves, some will be fails. I may read a new book that may really touch me and change me. I may share that with you guys. Um, it'll be still centered around beauty. I don't want my age to limit me. And I'm really about making the second half the best half. I wouldn't say that I wasted the first half of my life and maybe I was too busy people pleasing to really figure out who it was that I was and what I really liked and sort of just adapted to the community and the people around me to determine that. No more. So I'm changing, but it's for the better. It's growth. I am going to be growing and I am hoping that you will grow with me and that together Together we will find our best life in the second half, that we will learn from the mistakes that we made in the first half, and that we will grow from them. That we're not, we're not afraid of aging, we're just afraid of aging poorly. If I wanna buy Lux Beauty products, I'm gonna do it. Guess what? I've discovered that I really enjoy luxury brands. I think I was afraid to say that because I didn't want people to think that I was being too uppity or that I thought I was better than other people. I don't. I just enjoy them. And when I was younger, I could never enjoy any of those things because I couldn't afford it because all my money was going to raise in my family. Well, guess what? That chapter is closed. So I think I've earned the right to experience some luxury products if I'd like to. And I don't think that makes me bad. Please comment. Tell me if any of you are feeling what I'm saying. If any of you are getting this, if this is resonating or if I'm kind of wasting my time. I'm pouring my heart out here. I'm putting it all out there. My real authentic self. I am Mona Baggett. I am a 49 year old woman on my way to 50. I have three grown sons. 
I have a wonderful husband that I met when I was 16 years old working at Baskin Robbins. He became the love of my life. High school sweethearts were still married today, today and he is definitely the better half of this whole. And my children, my children are still my world even though they're young adults. But there is a chapter and there's a part of this book that belongs just to me. And I'm gonna find that chapter I'm going to find that place and I'm going to find those people who see me flawed and all and still like me for who I am and still want to be part of this tribe. I'm hoping that some of you, but it's important that we all find that. If it's luxe items, I want you to, to know that it's, it's an item that we're getting value from. So I don't want to waste my money on things. So I think a big part of my channel is going to be reviewing products and telling you what's worth it and what's not. We're gonna get into the nitty gritty details on skincare and beauty and lifestyle and experiences and decide what's worth it. Was that book worth it? Was that experience worth it? Being a nurse, I am an RN. I've been an RN since 1992. Um, I work for a global company and I cover half of the United States is my territory. I have the whole Western division of our company and sometimes that involves hard hats, and sometimes that involves working with construction workers, and sometimes that requires a plainer look. So you might see me without nails because sometimes that's not practical for what I'm doing, right? But then there are other days that I wanna glam it up. You can go from rags to riches look in your life. You can be both. You don't have to be one thing or the other. So just because I may work on construction sites and my job may bring me to some of the most interesting places and some of the harshest conditions for a little while, even those places are turned into beautiful works of art by the end of what we do. So the same can happen with me. I can be Girl Friday during the week with no nails and you know my hair up in a pony and a minimal makeup look and then on the end I can have my silk pillowcase and my silk eye mask and I can be pampered to the utmost. We are not just one thing. We are a multitude of things and people inside of one and I'm going to find out every facet of who Mona Baggett really is. So this about face change that I'm doing this may be the first of many, so hang on for the ride because we're gonna about face as many times as it takes to find out what face truly encapsulates Mona and all that she is. So comment, comment, comment. Don't be surprised that the next video that I upload will have a different name and a different look, but it's all gonna be exciting. It's all gonna be authentic. You're still gonna see beauty products. You're still gonna see makeup looks but we're gonna do the ones that are authentic to me. And I'm not gonna limit myself in a box because of my age. So if I wanna try a pop of color, or if I'm feeling my age and want a neutral look, if I wanna dye my hair purple, if I want pink highlights, whatever it is that I feel like trying, I am going to do. I'm not gonna let age limit me. And I hope that you don't let age limit you either. Get on this train and ride this journey with me discovering who we are, doing about faces, about faces, about faces, both of them, until we find our true authentic selves and are living our most fulfilled life in the second half. I hope to see you in the next video and I hope to hear what you think about my decision to be the real me and not just a people pleaser, no matter what that brings, below in the comments. Let me hear your voices. I'll be looking for you in the next video and I hope to see you there. Remember, new name coming, about face with Mona. Be looking for it. Same channel, just a different name. So if you're already subscribed, you're good. But if you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe now. And if you know of any other women in your tribe, your personal tribe, your online tribe who are going through the same things, who, who are about to reach another chapter of their life and might enjoy some of these experiences, invite them over to my channel. The ride is just getting started. Bye.